without the wall? Is there any agreement without the wall? Yeah, that's yeah. yeah. No, it wouldn't be. Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, yesterday, in a meeting with lawmakers, you said that you would be open to signing just about any immigration deal that that bipartisan group of lawmakers sent to you. That's right. Would you be willing to sign an immigration deal that ultimately does not include funding for the border wall, or would that be a red no. line for you? No. No. No? It's got to include the wall. We need the wall for security. We need the wall for safety. We need the wall for stopping the drugs from pouring in. Uh, I would imagine that the people in the room, both Democrat and Republican, uh, I really believe they're going to come up with a solution to the DACA problem, which has been going on for a long time, and maybe beyond that immigration as a whole. But any solution has to include the wall, because without the wall, it all doesn't work. Uh, you can look at other instances. Look at what happened in Israel. They put up the wall. They say it solved a very major problem. We need the wall. We have to have the wall for security purposes. Security is number one. And uh, so the answer is have to have the wall. Thank you. As I said, we're going to keep it short. So with that, I will take your questions. Major. Can you help us uh, clarify, when the Democrats came out, they applauded the President for organizing the meeting, but said it was their understanding this would be a two-phase process, DACA first, and then other elements that you outlined in your statement second, and that they perceived January 19th, not March 5th, as the deadline for action. Can you explain the President's interpretation of the meeting and that assessment of the Congressional Democrats. Right. Uh, the President just concluded what we felt was a very successful and productive bipartisan and bicameral meeting on immigration reform. During the closed door session, the leadership agreed to negotiate and narrow the focus to four issues border security, chain migration, visa lottery, and DACA. Uh, they all agreed that those four things would be part of the negotiation. Uh, and beyond that, then they could move uh, into additional scope. But at this point, those are the four things on the table and the four things that uh, we anticipate that they'll so be we'll negotiating. Jim? Yes, uh, just to be uh, crystal clear on this, uh, does the President want a wall in exchange for uh, giving those dreamers protection? The President wants border security. Okay. And, and just to be clear. Okay. So what does border security in, entail? Does it include the wall at this stage, or could the wall wait until later? Uh, the wall is one of the pieces, uh, as well as technology uh, and another a number of other uh, things that have been laid out by the Department of Homeland Security. I believe that Secretary Nielsen spoke about that pretty extensively at the meeting today, uh, That and that portion was covered by so you all during that time frame. It all has to be part of a deal in order for these dreamers to have protection. Border security does have to be part of uh, this want, process. I mean, there's, a di there's a difference, Why we right? want to secure our border? I absolutely do, because the safety and security of the people of this country are the President's number one responsibility right. and his number one priority when it comes to anything that he does. So absolutely. That, you understand how Andrew? the wall could be different than border security, sir? Border security can no, be actually, drones. I don't, it can Jim. mean agents, it could mean more fencing. It doesn't necessarily mean a physical And that's part of the negotiation the that we expect Congress to have. But you, and you and understand Democrats are saying that they may not be in favor of this kind of deal. That they're if not if Democrats are in favor of protecting American citizens, then I think we've hit a sad day in American history, but I don't believe that to be the case, because as we heard many of them say as they sat around that table when several of you were in the room, they are committed to border security. They do want it, and most of them have voted for it previously uh, before this legislation hit the floor. If so anything different no is just... If they say thanks but no thanks for a wall... Jim, I'm not negotiating okay. with you. I'm going to let Congress take care of that. 